guys, this is Joshua Lifer back again. Um, yep, I'm here with Rare PSC today. Um, and one minute, one minute, we'll do this one at a time. In the future, we're going to do this run, one at a time with me doing my intro first and then you do your intro. Fair? Fair. Okay, uh. Okay, yeah, and so then you'll get to hear both of our intros um, at different times, at different videos. Um, but anyway, um, so, um, let's see. Let, let, how about I go first today? Okay, so today, guys, okay, um, I don't know if you guys can hear me over on, on Rare PSC's end. Can you? If so, great. If not, okay. Um, but anyway, yeah. Like, like if you can hear me. Uh, thumbs down if you cannot hear me. How about that? No. Like, like if you can hear me. How about that? Um, um, anyway, but guys, um, today we are playing Grub Guardian, which is a cool tower defense game designed by King's Isle to train your pets. Um, we're actually, let's see, change does... Um, so what we're gonna do is we're going to, I'm going to introduce you to all of my pets on my main wizard that I use. So this is King Cookie right here. Say hello. Um, so King Cookie is a snake in a basket with Sprightly, Unbalancer, Balance It, and Gargantuan. So we're gonna quickly, um, just kind of go through and choose our pets. Um, we, we use one pet for the battle and then we use the towers. So, Red PSC, you go. I'm gonna, pa I'm gonna pause the video and it'll be your go. Okay, guys, and I'm back. Okay, so I'm. Um, I ended up choosing Gizmo, which is my adult wyvern, which is an ice. Um, my adult ice wyvern. Um, so yeah. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna run you all through. I think Sarah and I, Red PC and I, are gonna run you through the tutorial level, right? I well, I'm gonna run them quickly through the tutorial level because I feel it's important, um, which gives them insights. So. Welcome, young wizard, to the grandest game going, the one, the only, Grub Guardian! One, one minute, can, 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 I, can I please at least talk talk your guys through the tutorial? Okay, prestigious prizes, uh, uh, a plenty of weight, wizards, and their prestigious pets. How about a rapid rule review in order to reap these rewards? So, pet prizes equals strength, intellect, ability, I mean, agility, will, power, and me, and most importantly, experience. Other prizes include gold, mounts, cards, treasure cards, reagents, elixirs, and transformations, and other fun things like packs. I just realized that my microphone was on, so I repeat, and so... Oh, okay then. Um, I'm actually going to start my Oh, you, you are? Well, talk to them through, talk to them through the tutorial level. You're not? Okay, well... Anyway, so now, um, now, Splendid, now I'm your moment, six gangs of goons will come pouring out of this precarious, out of these precarious portals that are here. Those are the goons for this level. Um, six waves, or rounds of goons, will attack the dish. Their goal is to get the pet's food. You must protect it! When all town are stolen, the game is over. So I get a 2x2 two two pet guardian, then I get normal 1x1 one one pet guardians. Um, uh, other guardians. So, sorry. Um, which upgrade within school, um, by spell. So, 1 through 6 are the pet types. So the more mature my pet starts, like, my pet is an adult, so it is the third maturity. Um, it will be a different powerhouse kind. So there's seven pets here. That's brilliant. Um, let's go. So I, I will place my pets right there. Okay. I can buy more guardians by spending silver. So you don't spend gold. I spend silver. Which I think is a clever thing. Because if they made you spend gold, you'd be spending your wizard's money. Um, after selecting a square, a list of available guardians will appear. To build a gar guardian, select the guardian type icon. Try it. So I think I'll build a guardian right here, and I'll go... See, I I got this one, this one, this one, and this one, all from crowns. So I'll, I'll build you there. 
Okay, as you remove those rowdy riders, you'll gain back plenty of silver er, to buy new guardians or upgrade existing ones. Like the moon tower, I'll show you a cool effect about it. Because um, it doesn't do anything until something dies within its area. Plus two. Plus two. Um, okay. I'm going to need to level you up, aren't I? Okay. That'll take some time. Um, but the moon tower is actually worth it in the, as a long run investment. Um, and I'll, I'll show you why as as I get the monies to do so um, in other levels. Uh, this is kind of just a level to get your feet wet, really. Um, it's not a level to do much with. Um, so it, it, it it's it's boring, albeit. I'll, I'll admit it, it can be get a kind of boring, but it's a necessary level. Oh, uh, there we go. See now he he when they when they have that glowing moon look on them. Um, that, that's because he, he can then give extra monies when you kill them. And I think that, that, that's pretty useful, because the more monies you have, the better. So, you'll get extra monies from your moon tower in the long run. It's a better long-term investment. It pays for itself and more. Um, as do all the towers, but the moon tower especially. Rah, 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 rah. My wyvern's going rah, rah, rah. So I have it on fast forward so that I can hurry through this level. Um, and you, you, you don't have to put it on fast forward. But I do. I, I feel the need to put it on fast forward to speed things up because eh, life's a bit too slow for me. Um, so if I can speed anything up in life, I, I will. Um, yay! I earned a silver medal. Um, so from score to score and pet to pet, I'll get different medal ranks. Um, like, right now I'll feed my pet quickly. Um... Golden pizza? Eh, he ate it. It gave him th So now he has a total of nine extra experience um, that he just got from that level. And it costs a certain number, like with an adult cat, it'll cost six energy. So we are going to go over into Grizzleheim, and I'm, I, I actually am the master of Ravenscar. I am the Ravenscar king. Okay. 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 Oh, wait, now back. Sheesh. Pet placement is key, actually. Place my pet. So, um, I guess I'll place moon towers there and there instead of what? plan was. Um, so, anyway, but, um, Rare POC is kind of talking her people through the level um, that we just played, the tutorial level thing, um, which is important to do because it is. So, um, I'm going to help, I'm going to show you guys the p general strategy. Oh, no. Yes, please. Uh, <sighs> Just got to do it right, I guess. This is designed to work with any pet, but not always. It doesn't always work. So you just gotta play this exactly like I am, where you, it doesn't matter which myth tower you upgrade as long as you upgrade one, um, so that you have no monies left by the time they start coming, and you'll see why. So 
we're gonna wait a little bit. So the life guardian, um, the life guardian will um, help your help your guardian. Um, sorry, um, just really, really not in it today, um, very well. But these, uh, the life guardian will help your other pets do better in battle. Um, so right now my life guardian's at maximum um, assistance mode. Um, so I'll kind of show you how that'll work. Um. Oops! Sell it, sell it. I need death. I need death. That sounds like I'm trying to kill something. Um, let's see if I can't place a moon tower at, at the strategy point. death towers all this way um, really it, it does help why did I do that I suppose it was not on purpose really that's how you're gonna read him you're, you're reading him like that So what you'll find, guys, is, um, sorry, let me turn this music off. Um, what you'll find is, a lot of the time, your death towers are doing as much, if not more work, than your gen than your basic attack towers. Um, and that, that's, that's great. That's why they're there. They're there to completely demolish your enemies and help. But at the same time, if you can, I, I know it seems crazy, but the farther, the more you can upgrade your moon towers, the more monies you can make. And t take my word on it, too. Take my word on it. Because it, it will help you in the long, in the end. In the end, it helps. Uh, doot, 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 doot. So you don't have to do the moon towers if you don't want to, but I recommend them. If you can, if you can, so that they're at their max level, leaving just you guys, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. And and guys, guys. Okay, Rare PSC, I have something for that that probably you agree with right now, right? Okay. So um, have you been getting? I I've been getting some. Unconstructive criticism. See, see. And if you say that the bo video is boring, that that I've gotten complaints of that. Um, and no, 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 no. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. They say you should talk about something interesting. Well, tell me what's interesting to you. Tell us how we can help. Because we can't make it happen unless you tell us what it is. That That's the reality of the situation. Yeah. 
Ugh, replay. No, next. Feed the p So guys, I'm gonna pull a secret trick that I love doing. Um, I'm gonna show you the balance towers um, as a pet. He's an epic pet, so he's like up there with the best. Um, and he's gotten silver on this map, so that's how you know I'm good at it. To do. Okay, so, um, this is actually how I saw the st startup go. Uh, yay. This is boring. Speed it up, speed it up, we speed it up, we speed it up, we speed it up. Um, and... So, um, I should ex we should explain the dynamics of pet eating. Um, so, so do we want to explain that now? Okay, but eventually, guys, I think that when we actually have pets on our Let's Play Wizards, we'll explain the dynamics of pet eating and how, kind of how that works, because it, it, it it's weird. I'll, I'll admit it. It's weird. It's weird. I don't understand how it works, but it does. Um, actually, I do understand how it works. That's why I'd explain it, because I was I was completely confused by what a snack meant, by what snacks did, until I finally got to the point where I'm like, oh, so that's what a snack does. That's what a snack will do. That's what this and that'll do. Um, and it it was interesting. It really was. On what level? Oh, that one? Yeah, I used to have so much trouble. And I finally got See, I, I, I'm not perfect at these, I'm not, I'm not perfect at these maps, but I do try and keep it entertaining by talking, um, because if we can't keep it entertaining, what's the point, you know? So, if it's not entertaining to you guys, here, here's my challenge. Don't complain unless you can tell us what we can do to improve it. That is our challenge to you. Okay, and here's a challenge. Here's something that you sh that I want to do, um, but I need you got you guys to vote. Choose any school except life and post it in the comments. Um, within three weeks, in three weeks, I will read all the comments on this video. I will tally up each school that is not life, and I will have a life pet there, and I will put, I will go on this map, and. I will do this map with just that school and see how it works. And I will do it until, and I'll do it with every school that, and if it, there are multiple tops, I'll do it with all of those. That is my promise to you guys. That, it is going to be the one school challenge. The one tower challenge. So you have all these schools to choose from. No moon, no life. Those are your two choices. Those are the two things that are gone. No life, no moon. Um, cause I know... Oh, cause you, you got, you don't have moon, do you? Bam, bam. I decided I'm gonna alternate sun and fire. explain kind of um each tower has its own different effects death will do some instant kills um 
fire will leave them with a burn. Ice will slow them down on their court. Myth just, myth actually has no effect. Life uh, makes it easier for things to work. Um, balance can go, balance has a special kind of attack that will hit, at, that will hit a big chain of them all at once. Um, and so it's kind of cool the different kinds of attacks that there are. Um, but, but, here's the but. But, if you use them wrong, they're not good. So, you need to know what they are. So, I should explain, I'm going to explain why these giant craters are there. That's because of the sun tower. The craters act like a fire tower, however, they also kind of, they, they stay there and they do damage on their own as well as, you know, whatever else. So, um. How's about we put a moon tower there, and there, and balance here, and here, and you don't have to do these balance or moon towers. I find it makes the level a lot easier. Congrats! Congratulations! Um, I had, I had the maximum silver number. Um, ooh, I got a new high score. So that took a lot of pet energy. I just got five experience because I maxed everything out. So, two, three, four, five, two, four, six. I will take six instead of five. And if you notice, I have all my stats maxed out on this epic pet. So I'm just trying to get more experience. Um. Crundle Fjord. Crundle Fjord. Hey, hey, rare PSC. Guess what? Crundle Fjord is the hardest level to beat in the world. You know why? I think Crundle Fjord is one of the hardest levels to beat because in the end, there's just that one guy that you're just preparing for the whole time, and you can't beat him. I've bought all the map packs. Okay. Um, Azteca oh, is the only one that I haven't uh, unlocked this one. Okay. explain the um, Avalon Tower that I'm working with. It sends an electric shock that chains. It's kind of like the Balance Tower, but it's not nearly as big as the Balance Tower's effect. So guys, um, this is really fun for me to do, and I'm going to keep doing it. I'm going to, because what I'm going to do is I'm eventually going to start um, coming up, and I'm going to actually talk um, while I do quests, while I do these side games, or while I do Minecraft all I'll do uh, talk about magic and about all sorts of uh, fun stuff that I like to talk about. But if you guys have a specific topic you want me to talk about, um, keep it PG, and I might. I might. I might. I might. I might. I might. I'll malt. Because Gollum says malts. Um, I, I, I very well may. Or I may not. You just gotta, gotta, gotta sell me that it's PG-13 if it if it doesn't look like it on the outside and you will know so you'll have to sell me that it's sell to me that it is actually PG-13 um cause if it's not if it's not I'm not doing it I gotta keep it PG-13 um and I'll research the topic and such um but in general um I'll kinda talk to you guys cause there's a lot of things that I know people wanted um people will like wanted the ability to change your hair well Wizard101 added in wigs and that was pretty cool Change your hair and wear a hat? Not really, but change your hair. Wizard 101 added wigs. So Wizard 101 is really trying to please you guys. Um, and so, and I try to please you guys too. I don't know if you notice, but I try. I try. I try. The only question is, do I succeed? I don't know. If you smash that like button, I know I succeeded. If you don't smash that like button, I know I didn't. Um, can I get one like? Can I get, can, can I get someone... 
If if you sub if you enjoyed this video so much that you want to subscribe, that's brilliant. Um, I actually will leave a, this link up here in the description of the, the video. Ooh. Um, and so I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.